got it. <laughs> camera, filming, camera, so meta. Ooh, shit. We have station one. That's station one. You get your waiver checked out and make sure you're all good to go and all that. Then you go get your items. At station two, all your pre-orders and all that stuff. Hey, it's me. And station three okay. is Chrono over there. After that, you go check in with your faction personnel, your faction leaders and stuff. Yep. And then you go back to station five, which looks a lot like station one, but it's station five and you get a gold wristband. Yeah. All right, so we're about two hours into gameplay. Let me flip this around. I'm in the militia spawn right now. It's pretty spicy. Hi. Everyone seems to be enjoying everything. It's pretty good. Not really a whole lot of problems. I mean, I'd say no more or less than the average day of airsoft. There's a bunch of dudes up yonder in this here area. Let's walk over there. Usually this is not a lake, but let me tell you how rain works. So we got one of my refs right there. This is all that high ground up in here. This is kind of like a mid-ish, low-ish ground. So that's a lot of stuff going on in there. There is a, where'd it go? The gold mine over there somewhere. There's a, oh, there it is. There's a gold mine right up there. There's a gold mine up there. And everyone is shooting each other. Hello, fearless militia warriors. Boner Street boys are out. Boner! Haha, he dead. What do you have to say for yourself? Uh, <laughs> Lol. Well. Guys, I have the eyes. Hit that gold mine, guys. Let's go. Ow, somehow I got. Ow! Fuck me! So hot. Camera, filming, camera, so meta. Ooh, shit. How's your BB war? Uh, it's fun. <laughs> Yay. All right, we broke for lunch at about 11.30. It's about 12.50 right now. We're gonna get everyone back up and doing stuff at about 1.15. It's going pretty good. Look at this nerd. Dang. How's your BB Wars? <laughs> the intensity, the enthusiasm and excitement of this child. How's your BB War? <laughs> so it's about 2.15. Uh, we've been playing for a little bit. We had a lunch break until like 1.45-ish, I started yelling at everyone to get back on the field. That took about 15, 20 minutes uh, to get everyone set back in motion, but we did start back on time at about 2 p.m. Maybe like a few minutes after, but uh, I'm getting pretty good at this time schedule thing. Look at how pink and tactical I am. So the bomb is in play, so you have to take that to one of the objectives, or one of the ingredients, place it on the barrel, and then it goes boom in two minutes if they don't get to it. <laughs> Yay! The BBMC have successfully blown up one of the ingredients the militia needs to make moonshine, which means that ingredient is down for 10 minutes. That's kind of cool. So this is the still site. This is corn. That's a bootlegger. Right now they have two blueberries. One strawberry, and as soon as they get sugar. their sugar, because there's their water, so they need sugar, then we're gonna pop a red smoke, then they gotta walk one of those full-size kegs, all the way back to their spawn, and then they get points, go me. And this red smoke grenade means that moonshine is being cooked, and when this smoke grenade is done smoking, they will take those metal kegs, 
Back there. Oh, he's up there. You pick one. Yep. Hey, make sure when you set that off, you let a ref know you're set. Yeah. So it's about four o'clock. The score is Feather River Militia 169 to BBMC 231. Uh, but the militia have full control of the field right now. Uh, and they've kind of pushed the BBMC, the Blackberry Mining Corporation, back into their spawn point. They have them kind of pinned in there right now. And in a shocking twist of events, the militia are coming back. They might pull it off. Let's see who's gonna do this. Here are terms and conditions. Okay. You let us cook as much crack in moonshine <laughs> as we want, and you guys can have the gold. Only if you do it at the outhouse. How about, have the how about you get the dollhouse on weekends and we get it on weekdays? <laughs> All right, only if I get your mom on those over there. Negative, dude. His, daughter, his mom is like the hardest thing we got. Ooh. No, it's me. Yeah, I get your sister then. We have cousins. All right, that's fair. That's fair. We have yeah, tons of cousins. <laughs> now, hold on, are we talking first cousins? Hostage secure. Yes. Let's get him out of here. I told him I'm the commander. Maybe you <laughs> Hey, you can have it. Is he actually? <laughs> no. Yeah, we made him look like the commander. Okay. So, <laughs> commander, also, because <laughs> You know how you know I'm the commander? Don't you see all the radios on me? <laughs> what asshole gave you all those radios? Oh, shit. Wait, what the hell? I'm down a radio. Turn the camera I wish I was going to do Fine. As long as we get the kayak for the, the link. Uh, Copy. You have to let us move the moonshine right, though. Back. What's that? Only at night we'll moon our moon Yeah, do it all at night, right? And then, fuck Devin. Yeah, basically fuck Devin. Do we agree? <laughs> so, we're negotiating peace because fuck Devin. Yeah. We can agree Devin. to this? Peace. All right, Getting fuck Devin. Here we go. In a fantastic turn of events, peace was negotiated between the two factions. There is now peace in the land and coexistence and, you know, fucking puppy dog tails and shit. So it's Monday, uh, event's obviously over. I'm just chilling out waiting for a tow truck because my truck, you know, apparently ball joints, right? Am I right? Uh, so I'm sitting kind of like this right now. So, uh, Yellow Rock, huge success. We had 143 players with 11 walk-ons, which is pretty great. Uh, check-in was super killer. We really knocked check-in out of the park. A couple tweaks here and there I want to make to it, what, like some small, some small, like really just convenience level things and just like perfectionist level bullshit. Uh, fuck, check-in was killer. The Friday night game was killer. Knocked out some early check-in guys on Friday. Uh, knocked out some of their like early chrono stuff. The event was solid. A few notes that I want to do, like a few tweaks I want to do for next year. Uh, so, when, so for the gold mines, like here's one of the tweaks, like BTS, right? Uh, so let's say you're on the Feather River Militia and you take over a BBMC gold mine. Well, when it comes time to do the, the gold mine checks, which we do every 20 minutes, we're going to have it so that the point value uh, gets deducted from BBMC. So if they don't have control of that gold mine, they lose points. Now the FRM is not going to gain points, uh, but the BBMC will lose points. So there's a few tweaks I want to do. Uh, to the format, some small stuff, just to make sure like everyone and every platoon or every team or squad has something that they can do so they feel involved, so that it's not just fucking glorified deathmatch. But fucking event was pretty solid, dude. I was pretty happy with it. Uh, that's about it. Other than that, gonna wait for this tow truck. Caber, who the f are you, nerd?